we did intelligent Wi-Fi. So which means is this one right here, you go into detail and you go to three dot and there's a hidden feature called intelligent Wi-Fi. So I did one chapter on this one. Yesterday, I did a gallery lab. So when you go into your gallery, if you go back outside, go to three lines, go to settings. And I was talking about gallery lab yesterday. Today, is there any more app from a Samsung apps that has a lab inside? Yes, there is. Today, we're going to talk about my file. So we're going to go to my file. And then this is my file. Very simple, right? But if you go to three dot, and then you go to the setting, you see this setting right here. I don't know if you have been in here before, but this is a very important features inside that you need to know as well too. So if you go to about my file, and then you go to the, you know, the version, okay? So tap, 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 tap. Enable my file lab. So now we're gonna go outside, go back in and go to the setting. You should able to see my file labs. We're going in here. This one here has lesser features than the previous on gallery or intelligent Wi-Fi, but still somewhat important. First of all, you can see the first option is permanent delete options. You turn this on. So every single time, if you want to delete something through, okay, in here, there is this permanent delete inside. So once you press this and delete, it doesn't go to trash, it will delete right away. This is number one. But if you don't turn that on, it will go into trash can. The second thing is, it's actually reorganize your folder. So if your folder has more than 100 items, they will reorganize everything for you. Enable the default viewer. So uh, this one, I don't think is that important. I'm going to show you what that is. So this is how it looks like, the default viewers. So it will show you, you know, the image just like that without using the wording. But I don't think this is that important, I would say. But if you like this way of viewing your image and things like that, then it's good. But usually you will use gallery to view these image or videos, right? So I don't think that's a big deal. So if you go to the setting, okay, we're gonna go back in. There's like this developer options. So inside, inside the developer options, the very important thing is, it's same as like, you know, the previous video on the gallery, they will show you the data history. They will show you data history of your app. So right now, I'm just going to turn this on, which means that it will show you the history of your app. You can see image, videos, audio, documents, installations, files, compressions. It will show you by the graph how, uh, like what do you use most of the time. Videos occupy 11 gig. Image only occupy 164 megabyte. And this is by one day, you can see that. So they will show you the, all the information, data history through using this features. One of the very important features you might not even know is actually media files in pending status. And I'm not sure why this is here anyway, but you can see there is actually quite a bit, not that much. If I press select all, there is 22 files that is on pending files, but only occupy 1.7 KB. But for some people, if you use you know a lot on your phone, this could accumulate a lot. And if you do not have a feed, if you didn't turn this on, this will stay in there. Original files, edit videos, and files, uh, video files. So which means that if you ever had a photos and you want to edit in here, it will show you the original files for that image or videos. So basically when I had this phone, I, when I had this camera on, I don't really edit on my phone, but if you usually edit your photos or your videos, it will show up right here, your original files okay so in here it shows like that and so this is the my file labs if you haven't turned it on turn it on and take a look at this i think the most important thing is it's actually right here depending status see how many things is occupying you 
data history that shows you like you know what is occupied during those days and then the most important thing is it's actually permanent delete options these i'm okay with those but permanent delete options is quite important so please subscribe to my channel and share this video if you find this useful and subscribe and see you next time bye bye peace out